The Breakout Session Show. Yeah! If you had a good time on the show, this is it. And we are back! You are welcome to the Breakout Session Show. My name is Jemima Adeleko, and of course, I am your host. All right, I know that you expected something beautiful today. You know when you see me, something amazing is about to happen. So the Breakout Session Show is that show that connects you to your favorite celebrities and also serves as a global platform for the fast rising creative. And guess what? Today with me in the studio, I already have somebody special, somebody exceptional, I'm talking about somebody extraordinary, so don't worry, keep on, the guests is coming, and I'm going to be right back after each other. The Breakout Session Show. Okay guys, so before I went on that short break, I told you I have with me somebody spectacular. I'm talking about somebody extraordinary and I'm talking about the nun, but did you guess? Did you guess? And this person is none other but Bia Adeleke. Hello, Bia Adeleke. Hello. I see the way you walk. You're walking like the original Bia Adeleke, you know, with style and all of that. Thank you very much. Thank you have money. You. Uh, money. you must share this money. This money, you must spend it. We are trying. Actually. How are you doing? I'm very fine. How do you feel? I'm very well. Thank you so much. How That's do you nice. feel being on the show today? Um, Exciting. Thanks for having me on. Oh, yes. All right. So I'm just going to dive right into the interactive session. You know, a lot of people okay. want to know who was B Adelike before the B okay. of Adelike. You know, of now. So, who were you before the fame? Yes, because we um, know you're famous. Mm, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, maybe famous. Yeah, well, well before B. Adeliki, I was still B. Adeliki. Okay. Because, um, of course, so my, that's my name. But before then, mm -hmm. before people started knowing me, actually, right. I um, I actually was a filmmaker. I actually wow. studied filmmaking. Wow, who would have yeah. taught? Yeah, I went to a film school in South Africa. Then, um... I came back to Nigeria and um, finished my filmmaking um, course in um, Pefti's uh, film school in Lagos. Oh, beautiful. So I was majorly a behind the scene guy, mm. um, mostly all you know, this behind the crew, this thing. Okay. Um, miking up someone, being a Odin light and how before I developed interest fully okay. in uh, photography. Did you hear that? So being at the little world a filmmaker, did you yeah. have any point in town, you know, make any movie, you know, out there? Um, no, I was just, I was mostly part of the crew because, you know, oh. filmmaking was, was a very, very big deal. And it's yeah, still a very big deal course, now. So right. 
most of the time I was working, I was always behind the scene with um, WAP TV while I didn't have production. Mm. So I was just doing, you know, make sure I'm doing one wow. or two things. So what changed? What changed? How did you get into photography? Okay. It's, uh, because that it's is a, what we know you for. Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. It's, uh, it's not a long story. Okay. We were supposed to go for IT, I think, in my six month on um, school. That's the film school well, in Lagos. You training? Yes, yeah, so, okay. so I chose um, NTA Ibado. Oh. I was in their control room. I was in charge of the um, sound. Okay. So I had one man, he was a librarian there. He had a photograph. Well, he had a camera. Okay. So, of course, I was very familiar with camera. So, yeah. he'd be like, okay, let's You've just. Been a uh, yeah, yeah, already. exactly. So, he takes me out to events with him. Oh. In all these short, short politician events, maybe all these um, book launching and all. So, okay. I just go help him one or two. So, there was the time he could not go. He just said, he added me his camera. Then, I, okay, just go and um, try this out. So, I went and I did a pretty good job. Wow. I think I just never stopped from there. Wow. Wow. So basically, does it's a short story, nothing spectacular. So why is it that you don't shoot the regular? Why is it that you decided to focus your craft on the celebrity? You know, so that means I can't come to your studio to come and take pictures. No, I, I have think celebrity before I come to your studio. I think everybody. Are you sure about that? It's just that I make I can say I can make a person a celebrity. Really? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I think every every other person. But then there's a notion that says oh, be at the lake, just take celebrities no, and all of that. No, you know, maybe because that. maybe because how I started filmmaking, I was a little bit into it, so I knew so some of them. People yeah, exactly. Are people are friends and then. Well, of course, I still uh, I take regular people. Okay. I take so what has been people. the secret? You know, from just being a regular photographer. You know, is there any spices? <sighs> To mm. being a celebrity um, photographer. Because I know that it's not easy taking the celebrity. Yeah, Getting yes, them to yes, the studio yes, exactly, and all of that. Exactly. How has it been for you? It's, um, okay, when I first started, mm -hmm. it was actually very, very demanding. Because, um, okay. you know, shooting important people takes a... Uh, important. You, yeah, <laughs> you have to be... You just very, need very, to, like, yes, you now, shoot yeah. everyone. Yeah, I take everybody. So but let's just yeah, everybody's so, important. Let's just, right? Everybody's important. But right. known people, okay. they are actually busier than now yeah, our normal regular yeah, exactly okay. so they'll be like this time they might give you three o'clock you get at three they will start to like eight or nine p.m you oh, understand okay. so they'll be like so i just when i first started it was like i was like ah, what's so what's all these because they, they, hmm. they take they take time and most of the time they are so very very particular about pictures because hmm. um celebrities are actually very very how would i put it um, they are very careful about what you, the pictures you take, kind of picture. So they have, want to see everything from the first to the last. Day. Like if I take a normal, my normal client's picture, yeah. okay, then like, ah, mm -hmm. me, please, why haven't you, why haven't you posted? Post you post post, I, I, I just, I, I, I'll be like, I want you guys to have it for me. No, 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 no. Just put, but celebrity, you can't even. You know, you don't have get that a picture out. Thing. You don't. You don't. You have mm. to go through everybody. Then a manager will call you. This are the right. Sometimes you won't even, uh, uh, you won't be able to actually. Explore your own personal craft or like what wow. I think because they'll be like, This is so they come with their concept, yes, so, most, most of, of the them, time. Most of them come, wow. even, even if it's good or bad, they'll be like, This, this, and there are so many people involved, okay. So many people, they'll be the costume, yeah, the and you have to agree with everybody because mm. work on their they, own, they the one, yes, they're the one paying you. Wow. But say it's a, it's a collab uh, collaboration, of course, I put it okay, I don't want this, I'm not paying you, you're not paying, so yeah. it's uh, it should be. Uh, like a clash ahead of different ideas. Right. So that's but if it is not, you have to work with your own. Time. Yes, exactly. What they want. What any basically any customer, but most of the regular customers are actually very cool with it. They trust your judgment. But people in the field, celebrities, most of them filmmakers, they already know what's what. What they, they already believe they know um, everything. everything about the cameras. <laughs> so, and all. so you just have to dance with your tune and all. Okay. All right. So yeah. um, why yeah. Ibado? Why have you decided to stay in Ipado? Of all places, maybe I'm from Lagos, Potaka, Abuja. Do you think you would have done better if you were in Lagos or some other part of the country? Um, I get that question a lot. And funny enough, most people don't even know I am in Ipado. Yeah. Tell me something about that. Okay, because um, actually I've tried two years ago. I, okay. I, I was in Lagos for a year. Okay. But I fell sick. Of wow. course, Lagos. You Lagos. fell sick of Lagos? Yes, yes. Why? Ah, uh, the stress. I'm not. The traffic. I'm, I'm not built for stress, actually. I can see your skin is glowing. I, I understand that. I prefer the soft life, but okay. of course, Lagos. Most of the clients who are still in Lagos, mm. but I just thought, okay, 
when I started having this notion that what's the big deal about me staying or going to Lagos? Or I had my two assistants were staying in Lagos because bulk of like eighty percent of my jobs okay. are from Lagos. Yeah. So I had assistants living in Lagos. Two of them were living in Lagos. So maybe you know, if you have a shoot or anything, they go there before me. Okay. So they set up. So I just get there and mm -hmm. so I discovered that even if they leave their house earlier than well, let's <laughs> say the shoot is for ten o'clock, I thought they leave as early as seven. Yeah. I still get to the Venue before, venue before them. them. Wow. So they were like, we've been in traffic for four, five, six hours. So I was just like, what's the point? Just get a driver yeah. and do my thing. And the peace here in Ibadan, and I believe Ibadan is actually a growing city because there are some deals happening in Ibadan that I've never thought would happen three, four, five years ago. Wow. Ibadan is growing. The economy, um, what's it called? It's, it's actually at, at a very, very rapid speed. Mm -hmm. So, but no, it's not as bad as the way people portray it. It's so, people are here, they are business, they are rich, they are business people here. So, are you saying all the celebrities you should come down to Ibadu, or do you have a studio over there? Or you yeah, go to a, there? There is a studio there. In Lagos? Except we are in for, for some different, and, and most of them, there are some shoots that they can't even achieve with now. Lagos? For crying out loud, people come from Lagos to even shoot movies. In right, Ibadan. Yeah, Ibadan. they spend a month lodging hotels. So right. the same way they be like, okay, Ibadan is more peaceful. They can move around. There are more places to use. And it's uh, not like it's cheaper, but it's more affordable. Like there are some places you can, there are some resorts that are not in Lagos right. that are in Ibadan. Mm. So some clients, like if we want to, there are some, there's a person I shot at, um, what was it, called? Cultural Center. Okay. Yeah, it needed stuff like that. So we could not find, okay, just come to Ibadan, spend two, three days. Mm -hmm. And we, Achieve what we wanted wow. to achieve. But some most times we travel, Lagos, Abuja, if the like like if the clients are not not everybody likes traveling. Mm -hmm. So I, my, most of them don't even know. Okay. That I'm saying, well, I'll be like, I just came back from Iran. Like, wow, really? Yeah. I'm like, don't come stick up, it's not even far. Okay. And the number they one, two hours. Uh, your, okay. All you right, so we are still here on the breakout session show and I'm hanging out with your favorite. The Breakout Session Show Welcome back from that short break. I'm still hanging out. Sweet Biggie and Delicate. I hope you're feeling good. Yeah, I'm fine. All yeah. right, so hmm, I've learned a lot, you know, talking about mm -hmm. Lagos, talking about Ibadan, and all of that. You know, there's this notion about photographers. I don't know how true this is, so I'm going to be asking you directly because there are a lot of people, you know, have this question in their heart, and I'm okay. going to be asking you directly. Now, they say in quote that photographers like women. You know, you have a lot of women coming to mm. your studio. You know, some people even <laughs> open their body, and you take them this perfect picture. How did you handle, you know, relationships while working? Okay. You know, with your uh, with, your, with your let me say your client how do you undo that the female clients female client especially okay. how do you undo that i think it's just uh the notion that photographer likes women it's, you hear the same thing about doctors they say doctors like oh know. they say that too yeah they say it. They, they say, they say, they say it. so i think and you, you hear musicians like women they say every Everybody, <laughs> Everybody likes women. That's why. But something. It, it, um, the thing about photography is like, it's different because, of course, women likes pictures. Okay, of course, they like pictures. They like pictures a lot. A lot. A lot. So it's. I think that's why it's a little bit different. Because, say, ninety nine percent of my clients are women. Women. Hmm. I don't think a man has ever. Maybe once in a while, a man, a man would chat to me. Hmm. Like, I, I want to have a shoot. Like a man, okay, strange, but okay, we'll do it. Man but, of the mm, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> We've been about photographers liking women. Hmm. I'm not sure about it. Hmm. I don't think so. Because I heard the same about doctors. Hmm. I heard the same about every every profession. So but do you, you are it's the person, just do you like do you like um, ladies? Like ladies, 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 ladies. Um <laughs> I like everybody. And, um, I'm not saying everybody. I'm ladies. a lady. Yeah, I, like I, have to, ladies, I have to like you know? I have to like men now. So if you... Um, I'm, 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 I'm straight. Okay. You expect me to like men. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> okay, so has there been a time that you've ever crushed on your client? You know, female client, of course. Yeah. 
Yeah. Really? It, yeah, it happens. Just about it. it happens. Yeah, it happens. Of course, now it happens. Just me. I want to know the experience. What was it like? Of course, there yeah, are some people you know that okay, this this uh um this is a no go area. You can okay. probably then you just have to crush from a, from a from far. far, yeah. And there are some people you'll be like, Okay. Let me give you a try, let me shoot my shot. Okay. I've actually dated a client that I liked. Hold yeah, on. Fine. Did you did you hear that? He has actually mm. dated Yeah, his a client now. Clients are people you meet you meet people you date. Yeah, though, how did it happen? He happened. So you know so you photographers like, after shooting, you now say, okay, come and register your number here. You now be texting them. <laughs> yeah, no, only no, the no, name of course, they want to send them course, pictures. Of course, uh, you have your client's number. Oh yeah. That's um, it starts from a, um business relationship, business wise. Okay. So probably you guys, person. yeah, yeah, of course. That's so that means a this business. person you dated happened to be your client. That's not the first time the person is shooting with you. No, no, of course not. Okay, we so were, there was it was like just mature... business, yes. Okay. Then we started talking. Then sometimes, because I have my business number and I have my own personal okay. numbers, then you find yourself exchanging personal numbers. All right, so you know. said you started talking. What was the talk like? It's like, hello, I just want to check up on you. Hello, have you eaten? Hello. Um, or when yeah, are you coming to shoot with okay. me? Uh, what's up, bro? I like my pictures. Please, can you help me do... Okay, okay, no problem. Can you help me... Okay, no problem. Okay, okay one more thing. I think she was now into... She was selling some stuff. So I said, oh, like, okay, okay. I need some... I need to buy this. Hmm. You know, okay, all right. Hmm. Um, Let me send you my personal number. Okay, so we, exactly, exactly. Like exactly. But I don't want my... This is a business mm. line. So from there, do you like it? Do you have somebody that installs it? Okay, okay. okay. From there. So from there, I'll send me a picture. Let me see what it looks like. Okay, so nice. Let's meet. So... Uh-huh. It happens now. Once you talk to somebody for a long period of time, yeah. you tend to start getting affection. Okay. So is that person still on <laughs> point now? Or we are we are friends. On now. vacation. Yeah. <laughs> we are friends. We are good we are good friends now. All right, so that's that's a beautiful one. Who would have thought? Someone like this would date. Ah, ah. Because they'll be people when they come to your studio. I'm talking about, you know, uh, photographers in general. They're always for me. We are dear, we are dear, we are dear. Yeah, so people can crush. Who do you want to be for like me? This? Like this. No, 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 you crush. No. People crush on me. I'm sure you have crushes. You, you've crushed I, I don't know about that. Okay. I, I don't know about that. But you know, it's not about me. It's about being a delicate. Okay, yeah. All right. So with, this, um, <laughs> with your level of experience yeah. is, you know, in the year. And of course, I know that you put so much hard work in what you do, commitment oh, yeah. and all of that. Mm-hmm. Would you... Have you ever thought about leaving B and Deliki as a brand? If you don't do photography, what else would you do? Uh, probably, like I said, mm. I'll probably be a filmmaker. Mm. And if not that, if not anything really, I'll probably be a music producer. Because mm. I, I knew I was just not cut out for 9 to 5. Oh, 9 job. to 5 no, job. No, I was never good. And I'm not a good business person. I'll just give all my goods out. Okay, so, okay. If I wasn't a photographer, mm. I'll be a filmmaker. And oh since the photography is still in the line of film, right. if I wasn't doing it, I'll definitely be a music producer. Mm. Okay, so let me paint this scenario to you. Okay. If you get a nine to five job and they are paying you two million naira per month, that's twenty four million naira in a year. Would you quit the be a delicate brand and go for twenty four million naira? Nope, why won't? Before that, after the 24 million naira, they're going to relocate you to the USA or Canada or anywhere no, you want to no, go. No, I won't. So you will quit the money. I'll, I'll leave them. I'll, I'll leave them. But money. why? You don't like money. You need money for the gadgets, you know. Yeah, I know, but 2 million naira, no. It's not like it's No, it's something. Money. It's not, <laughs> but uh, uh, potentially, the name can get me. Even no, I won't more. Even, I won't collect 2 million. I won't. What if they up it to like 3 million naira? No, I won't. 100 million naira? Per month. Per month. Let's just see. Uh, no, but who wouldn't now? <laughs> so you will quit the brand be and like for yeah, 100 million naira. Uh, 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 right, it's a here now. Uh, I'm not saying like 100 million naira cash. That take. Like salary pay. Oh yeah. Well, wow. let's be oh, realistic. Really, Nobody will like pay you 100 million naira. And no... Of course, I will now. It's, it's, what if uh, I want to pay you 100 million? Why would you say nobody can pay you 100 million? I'll give you my I'll, I'll, like <laughs> I'll give you my mother's name, any name that you want. I'll, I'll, I'll give you 100 million. I won't even yeah. I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't start B again. <laughs> the breakout session show.
Welcome back to the Breakdown Session Show. I'm still hanging out with B. Adelike. And now this is the most anticipated segment of the show. You know what I'm talking about, right? The uniqueness of this segment is where we get to connect the fast rising creative together with the already made creative. I'm talking about the celebrity guest. And the uniqueness of this show is that the fast rising creative get to ask for one thing from our celebrity guest. So let's find out if our celebrity guest gets to answer that one request from the fast rising creative. Be a delegate. Are you ready for this? Yes. You sure am. you're ready for this? <laughs> All right. I'm sure he is ready for this. So I'm going to be bringing up right now the creative. This person is somebody that I've seen his work. I've seen how good he is. I don't want to overhype him, but you sure you're in for this. I am. He's good though. <laughs> the guy is good though. I'm talking about the one and only Ade Oluwa. Ade, Ade. Walk wow. like Ade now. Oh, Ade. Okay. <laughs> How are you, Ade Oluwa? How are you feeling? Very well. Sitting next to you is Bia Jeleki. Show wow. me excitement. Wow, wow. What a wow. <laughs> like, <laughs> what a wow. <laughs> All right. Have you heard about Bia Yeah, sure, sure. Hmm. What, did you, what did you know about Bia Jeleki? He's a badass photographer. Badass. As in badass. Like, he's good. <laughs> bad. Are you sure your, yeah, your work yeah. can beat his own? No, you not know. really. No. But I'm in line with it. You are in line, but you're not sure. Yes, ma'am. So you don't want to overhype yourself? No, no, no. no, no. Hype yourself, no. Overhype you, make yourself problem. Okay, oh, <laughs> okay, I like that. All right, so can you tell us about yourself? Okay, I am Adeolua, the Adeolua. The Adeolua. At T-H-E. What did you say? I said Atiku T H E. Atiku T. Is that your son? No, no. So what's up with the Atiku T H E? I can be, be like I am D. D. Oluwa. Oh, great. All right. So basically, I am a, I am a photographer, mobile photographer. Like I use my mobile phone to so create wow. images. Mm. So that's it. So Adi Oluwa, what that's inspired me. you using your phone? You know, yeah. why not cameras? Why not you know all the, I don't want to say better, but other okay. bigger gadgets. Okay. Wi-Fi. First of all, I I said I discovered that I loved taking pictures. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I did not even think of using a camera or something. Hmm. So I just I I admired that phone photography. I did not even know it was a, it was an accepted um, thing in the world like the mobile world. photography. I just did my own thing. Mm. So when I got to Instagram and other stuff, I started seeing other mobile photographers too. I said, wow. So okay. the other people that do these things. So is there like an association for phone? You know. Phone, Not really, but there, are, there, are, there are Instagram um, societies or communities like okay. that. Okay. Oh. I don't think there's an association like that. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So I get what you have been up to okay. is, you know, using your phone, um, trying to snap pictures and all of that. Yes, do you think it's actually acceptable? How do you feel when you take your pictures? Do you get engagement on your post or what, are the, what has been the feedback? Okay, yes, yes, it has been acceptable, very acceptable. Mm. Because when I post my um, images on, on Instagram, okay. I get a lot of Engagement. comments, nice comments actually, then likes. Then I also, I also have clients, like it does have clients too. Right. Like I do photo shoots, better photo shoots. Hmm. But not just in With your phone? Video. Yes, ma'am. Amazing. Not just indoor photo. I don't use, um, I don't use lights. So I just make use of natural lights. That would be outdoor photography. So I don't okay. do indoor. Because I don't have the lights and all of that stuff. Hmm. So I do outdoor photography basically for photo shoots. So I've done a quite number of photo shoots, very photo shoots actually for, for people, mostly for girls. People with your phone, just yes, shooting your phone. Yes, what are the apps you use? Or when you just take the pictures, you just put it out there? Or is there a sort of editing like the yes, normal yes, camera? Yes, yes, when I first started, I started with my camera and just my gallery editing stuff. Editing, okay. Then I wasn't using a good phone then too. So I just, but now you're using a good phone. Glory! <laughs> so, oh, you're still not using a good phone? I'm using a good phone. My phone Great. is quite good. I thought you were from my hand. <laughs> <laughs> so I was just using my, my gallery um, features to edit okay, stuff. But now I know about um, apps, editing right. apps for mobile, for phone, hmm. mobile apps. Hmm. Hmm. There are you know, a, a quite number of them that I use to edit pictures. So, um, B. Adeliki, what do you think about Adiolua? What, yeah. what do you think about him in person? And That's, it's craft. Yeah, I think it's a very, very interest. Actually, phone photography is actually more interesting than hmm. what I do because they actually get to do. It's more like a documentary what they do. Okay. So they like more. They get to do what they feel. Okay. Not like what they are being told hmm. to do. It's actually very interesting. They get to explore 
And it's, though I try to do it, but I know it's very difficult. It's not very, very easy. Mm. Taking good pictures with your phone, you always have to be on the lookout for interesting stuff to take, because, okay. you know, it's, it's a moment. I miss a moment. I see a sunset, okay, let me take this is a perfect this I actually do admire. I have a couple of guys like that, like I so it's actually do that admire. You, you, you appreciate. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So Adiolura, here's mm -hmm. the thing. The moment we are right now, the moment we are in right now, is a very critical moment. Okay. It's a serious moment. Okay. Are you tensed? No ma. Are you sure? Yes, ma. Say it like a minute. I don't yes, want to be able to <laughs> I don't want to <laughs> motivate you, but okay. are you sure you're not tensed? At all. All right, so I want you to think. In one minute, okay. you're seated right next to be Adeliki, you know, and it's somebody you look up to. Now, what is that one thing you want be Adeliki to do for you? What is that one request you want him to do for you? TikTok, TikTok. Okay. okay. So actually, I will. Are I'll... you sure? Think about it very well. Don't be tense. You know, breathe in and out. Are you breathing in and out? Are you sure? <laughs> All um, right, so let's have it. Adieu, Liwa. Okay, so, actually, I would like to step up my... Okay, so yes, yes, I'd yes, like to, yes. <laughs> I would like to step up my game in this photography stuff. Okay. I would like to go beyond mobile. Hmm. Okay, yeah. So, yeah. I would like to, to request... My golden request is yes. that um, I want a... a, a what, what would I call it now? A tutoring from you. Okay. Hmm. From you. Okay. Like a deep tutorial, like on, on use of camera and editing, mm. not just mobile now, sir. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Me, when you think a deep <laughs> tutorial is what a dual world wants, yeah, it's, it's, what it's do not, you No problem, it's fine. Thank you so just much, Just like sir. that? Yeah, it's fine. Like, just like that? No problem. I'm, I'm under the spotlight. You want, right. me say, <laughs> <laughs> you want me to say no? <laughs> wow. If you say uh, no, <laughs> if you say no, I'm pretty sure Adioli will be there at the crowd. It's, it's fine, it's fine. No Thank worries. Thank you so much, sir. Oh, and you know, yeah. so you got your golden, your golden, your golden request. You want something really deep. I'm pretty sure that's worth millions. I don't know how much you charge, and I'm pretty sure it does not just take students, yes, you know, just any other. I don't so even take people. You don't even take people, not yeah, even students. It's fine. So it's a great privilege for you, at your yeah. So all money. thanks to you. <laughs> be a delicate. So what do you have to say to be a delicate for, you know, an amazing opportunity that he has given to you. I would say this is a big one for me, a very big one for me, because I know how much people charge to, to learn photography, okay. even from big um, photographers like him. Okay. And sitting with him alone is a very, um, I feel on top of the world. Like you're starstruck. <laughs> alone. Like, oh my God. <laughs> like, what is going on? This is being a delicate. Okay, ha, wow. Kim on. <laughs> Kim on. Okay. So I'm right. so grateful to you, sir. Yeah, you welcome. So. Nice to nice meet you. you. Okay. All right, all right, guys. So I'm still hanging out with B Adelike and Ade Olua, and I'm going to be right back after this short break. Go to where and stay tuned. The Breakout Session Show. Welcome back from that short break, and I'm still hanging out with B Adelike and Adeolua, and it has been an awesome moment, I must say. Thank you so much, B Adelike, the one pleasure. and only celebrity photographer in the whole world, right? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on the Thank breakout you. session Thank show. You for we really me. do appreciate. I hope if I call you next time, you're going to. Of course. All it's right. So I have a little, little something for you on behalf of the oh, breakout. Powerful session show thank you very much i really do appreciate it you're welcome a very big thank you to each and all of you that stay tuned on the breakout session show today i had so much fun and i bet you did as well do not forget to follow us on all of our social media platforms as displayed on the screen you can also get passed out with me on instagram all you need to do is just follow at Jemima's Lifestyle, and let's have some more fun. Until next time that I come your way, I remain your host, Jemima. Over to you, Van. Okay, we are back. The rebel, the rebel, the revelation. Hey, are you ready? Yeah. If you are feeling good vibes, if you are ready to dance, are you, are you?